Let's look at the main factors. 1. Vocal cord length and thickness. Just like thicker guitar strings make deeper sounds, thicker and longer vocal cords produce lower-pitched voices. That's why most adult men tend to have deeper voices. Testosterone during puberty thickens their vocal cords. In contrast, thinner cords vibrate faster, leading to higher-pitched voices, more common in women and children. But there's tons of variation within each group. Some men have high voices. Some women have deep, rich tones. It all comes down to biology, hormones, and genetics. 2. The shape of your face and skull. Yes, your bones affect your voice. Your sinuses, nasal cavity, and skull structure all influence how sound resonates. A bigger head cavity can create deeper, fuller resonance. A narrower nasal passage can create a more nasal tone. Your cheekbones, jawline, and even how far your tongue sits can tweak how your voice sounds. 3. Your tongue, lips, and speech habits. Anatomy plays a big role, but behavior matters too. The way you learn to speak, your accent, rhythm, tone, and pacing adds layers to your voice. Two people with identical vocal cords might still sound totally different just based on language background, cultural habits, or even how animated they are when they talk. That's why identical twins can have distinct voices, and why you can sometimes tell where someone's from just by how they say, coffee. Your vocal cords are like your instrument, but you're the player. And just like any instrument, it gets shaped by practice, environment, and time.